Hey, hello everyone, Analytics Sage, Monday 23rd of November 2020, time is 4 o'clock p.m. UK time. I'm giving an update on Euro USD. The last video I published, I draw a price trajectory and I mentioned I'm expecting the market to go back up and then crash. So this was the price trajectory I draw and market kind of followed my idea. So it went back up to the price i expected and then crashed but the question is it gonna move the market down to this level as i expected or not let me go to three hour chart i will explain a couple of scenarios for you so for the wave four correction we had the a okay then in my opinion we had a b and then we are on a C. This is what I think. But the fact that we have impulsive here, you have to be very careful because that could be the wave one. So we can assume that this was the end of wave four and the opposite scenario is that we had the wave one all the way up. Then we had the correction in the form of A, B, C probably, and then all the way up. So, uh, what matters is that this was the common scenario between both bullish and bearish scenarios so i'm having a short position but i'm carefully watching my position i can't confirm if the market is uptrend or downtrend until we break one of these levers first the top of the wave 5 1.19 if the market comes down and breaks all the way up then we can confirm this is an uptrend or we have to somehow break the beginning of the impulsive wave which is 1.16 in between we only can make prediction based on the structure of the correction or the structure of the new impulsive wave done i will try to keep you updated if i find more evidence supporting uptrend or downtrend but for now, I'm expecting the market at least to get to this level, 17 point, uh, 1.1739. It has a chance to come down a little bit more. But if the market starts to come down, then I will give more chance to the bearish scenario. And my first target is in this box you can see here in red. Thanks for watching and let me know if you have any questions.